Yo, what is good YouTube? John Chris here. We come back at y'all with another vid. And man, today was today was kind of a crazy day, guys. It's it's kind of been insane. Like it it really has. Like first of all, uh so today another surprising drop. I kind of felt like this was coming. I know it was going to come out this soon because uh anyways, yeah. So, bam. Got them. The Concourse just released them early on the Nike sneaker app. People was hitting me up left and right. I actually, thank you for everyone that hit me up. I appreciate y'all. I can't say all the names, but thank you so much, everyone. You guys know who hit me up, man. Everybody. Shouts to uh, the sneaker Twitter, whatever. They they posted on, uh, I got that on the notifications real quick. So bam, I was at work. Got through really easy, and I saw a lot of people ate. That just tells me how many pairs that these Concords gonna have. I mean, I think we're talking higher than where the Space Jams came out. Right here, the Space Jams. Basically, with the full five that came out, these are the recent ones. Uh, these were like over a million pairs and they all sold out. So, as from what I'm hearing, it's even more than that, including like GS size and preschool. Like, we're talking like 1.5, like almost 2 million. Like, it's, it's gonna be a lot, a lot of pairs. So do not trip, guys. I think everyone should be able to get a pair. I don't think there should be any murdering or killing or hitting or, or anything like that. Because usually you guys know, you guys been around, guys, you know, especially as long as I have, like with the sneaker game, with all the, with, you know, the concourse, every time the concourse, especially when, when these came out, right here, 2011. Anyone out there that actually got this pair, you had to get in a fight to get these things. It was insane. It was crazy. Back then, you can even call up East Bay back then. You know, it wasn't the internet how it was. So to get to these things at the mall, man, these, it was a fight. Like it was, the line was crazy at the mall. There was actually, I believe it got even shut down because there was a shooting. Like that's how crazy it was. And even when the Concord Lowe's came out, it's gonna be insane. But now with the ones that's about to come out, I think we're gonna be okay. There should be no mass murderings. But then again, you never know. But anyways, I think, but for real, I, honestly, guys, just just be be careful. But still, just do some work when these things come out. I'm just glad I don't have to worry about it. It's gonna come in early from the Nike app, from Nike, and I'll be good to go. Can do that review for y'all. I might still do it. Just pick up a pair for the misses and for my sons, because you know I do want my sons to have the Concourse. It's just fresh, especially for toddlers. You know, it's it's really nice. But well, I think these things will sell out. For uh, the you know with the high patent cut, the patent leather cut, the 45 in the back, I mean I'm definitely need a cop. Right, I got every Concours that ever released except for the OG ones because they're just they're a little too much. Anyways, got the 2011 pair. This is the one you just it, this was this kind of almost basically what changed the game the sneakers to is today because of this shoe. Like the sneakers was hot, but this just brought it to where mamas and everybody was getting to Jordans, okay? And uh, of course the Concord 11s. This was a cra this was crazy too. There was fights at the mall for this thing too. We were running through it just to get these things. It was first come first serve. It was insane. So another one's crazy. And of course my favorite, my personal grails, the DMPs. Yes sir, back in high school 2006. Yes, my actual grail grails right here, bam. So, and also, I haven't, I don't get to wear this that often, but it's actually pretty decent shape for what it is. This is the 2000 pair, yes. It's uh, a little toe separation, definitely some yellowing, you guys know. If any you guys new sneakerheads out there, yes. The sole, it does turn yellow. It used to look like this, now it looks like this. This is uh, almost 20 years now, 18 years. So, yes, soles will get yellow. I know, it's crazy. So yes sir, the Concords, you guys you guys should know, Concords is actually one of my favorite silhouettes. It's, you know, it's not my absolute favorite Jordan, but it's one of the, my favorites because it's just such an iconic shoe because this is the shoe that Jordan came back, you know, uh, you know, the, his full regular season come back from retirement. Please do not say the 10s because that wasn't the full season he came out, okay? I'll give you guys a history lesson about that. He came, On the 94, 95, he came back middle of the season during the playoffs and he wore the 10s and then the playoffs he wore these. And then the, the next year he wore the Jordan 11s and they, they went 72 and 10, okay? And I'll go more in depth in history lesson in other videos. But guys, do not trip. 
uh, December 8th, I believe. Yes, December 8th. These will, uh, the con the Concords that just came, that just came out, they will be a wide, wide release uh, during that time. So please guys, do, do not worry. They will come out. Oh, let me do this again. But if you guys didn't get the quick little early release peekaboo surprise uh, drop from today, do not worry, December 8th, two, only two weeks away, okay? Only two weeks. Yes, they will release world, you know, wide. Worldwide, everywhere, Foot Locker, Foot Action, uh, Finish Line, everywhere, in, and the Sneakers app again, they will release again, a lot, okay? So, and it's gonna be many, many pairs. Everyone should be able to eat. It's gonna be a pizza party, okay? So there's no re there, there should be no absolutely no resale because I mean seriously does Jordan even resell? So yes, uh, and the thing is that the, with this shock drop, man, I think this really took a hit against those people that's trying to sell early, you know? Because I think if people are trying to sell early two weeks early, it's like it's a lot, but you know it's it. So I guess Nike, man, Nike, they are they they know man they they know what to do but all in all just just be patient guys it's only two weeks away okay guys just wait it's only two weeks just hold on okay don't go on stock x because right i believe stock x i saw the price was like 350 for these things okay do not just 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 wait okay guys just just wait be patient there should be plenty plenty pairs especially when everybody's doing from the foot app now and all that people will get multiple pairs i might even double up myself to be honest so just, just be patient, guys. I think everybody should be able to eat and cook and, and all that. So don't worry and all that. So anyways, another news today. Gosh, man, there's a lot of news today. So uh, I also took a W on the Foot, uh, Foot Locker app, BAM, for these things. BAM, the Yeezys, yes, Zebras, they're re-released again. And shout out to my dude Skinny because <laughs> he said, the zebras is basically like the concours of the Ye of Yeezys or anything, you know, because I mean, this is the third time they're releasing. Can you imagine these things used to release or uh, resell for $1,200 last year? Last year. And now they're barely going for uh, retail right now. And then once they release, pfft, they're, they might even go lower than retail. So if I was you guys, uh, everybody should be able to eat. I saw there's plenty, plenty of pairs. I saw a lot of people on IG, they took some W's. A lot of people took W's. Especially on the foot apps, you know, on the Foot Locker, the apps of Foot Locker and Foot Action and Champs. I saw people win, won multiple pairs. I actually won two pairs, to be honest. I won on Foot Action and Foot Locker. It's just that I only need one. It's for the homie, it's not for me, because I, I already got my pair. This is the 2000, this was last year's, okay? So, yeah, I'm actually really curious to see if there's any difference, because I heard there was a little bit of, of the soul and stuff. So, and I already got two pairs of these for myself. So, I really don't need it. I'm just gonna get this for the homie. And check it out. Pick it up. I'm gonna pick it up tomorrow because I, I want it. I'm gonna go to Foot Locker. So make sure you stay tuned. I will do another mall log on that. See if they're gonna be sitting, to be honest, because I just hear so many pairs are out there. There's a lot, a lot, a lot of pairs. So, like I said, Yeezys, it's just, Adidas overall, like, there's, there's not much resale going on. Like, to be honest, it's not, not so much going on at all. So, I, I just think, you know, it's it's fine, you know, resale doesn't have to be, not everything has to be for resale, you know, it, it's fine. If you want the shoe, you're able to get it, which is actually fantastic for the actual sneakerheads out there. But for anyone that's worried about resale and all that, because I understand resale is a business, you know, so I hope everyone understands that. I know people hate the resellers and all, but just understand, it's, it's a business, guys. You know, it is what it is. If you don't like it, then don't pay for it. Go on, there's another shoe coming out next week, okay? So yeah, I got, uh, shoot, I got like three, so basically I got like three Ws today, so it was pretty good. But the only thing I didn't get a W on, I uh, heard the Rookie of the Years came, uh, was was an early access. I even heard people, this, I'm, I'm reading, I'm showing this from someone online sent this, so yeah. Bam, um, the Rookie Years was an early access, exclusive access or whatever. So yeah, uh, apparently some people got that early access, so shout out to everyone got it, but for some reason people couldn't cart. I don't know what the deal was on that. I don't know, but uh, Nike said, <clears throat> like some people, they couldn't cart on these things when they got the early access, like they jumped around it and they couldn't even cart or the sales sold out. Apparently Nike tweeted out earlier, they said that it was an error, so it's gonna just go ahead and release on the sneaker app. So. This is gonna be my main number one thing of the weekend. I'm gonna to have to camp out. Hopefully I hit on the reservation. So yeah, I got I got a reservation on for one. I got a 10 minute start for one foot locker. Hopefully I win, because usually that mall is kind of bougie. They don't want people to camp out. But other than that, man, these things are first come first serve, yo. Like I'm, 
I'm actually kind of nervous. Like seriously, maybe not my area, but for everyone else's area, guys, like especially like New York and stuff, like I'm actually a little scared. Like, cause I don't know. Like some people don't like it, you know, whatever, it's cool. You know, I got my re reserve. I got one reserve. Hopefully I win that. If not, I have to camp out early in the morning. So I have a mall vlog on that as well. <sighs> this week's gonna be crazy, man. A lot, a lot of content, a lot of things going on guys. So just make sure you guys stay tuned to the channel, man. Cause I gonna be pumping out some good stuff guys. Like I really am. Hopefully I am. Cause I'm gonna do some mall vlogs, bring the camera out. Try to cop these shoes. If not, you know, anyway, so yeah, so Saturday, so anyway, so so yeah, so the agenda to so the agenda is gonna be tomorrow, Friday, pick these up, bam, gonna pick these up, do my vlog on that, see these things are sitting and, and whatnot. And then the next day, Saturday, uh probably you know, gonna have to camp out, get those rookie years, or try to get them online or something. It's just like I said, it's gonna be an insane, insane week, man. And then reviews, so on and so forth, and just make sure you guys stay tuned, guys. I would, I really appreciate everyone out there. Thank you so much for rocking me. I really, really do. Thank you so much, guys. Make sure you guys stay tuned, guys. A um, couple of little announcements. If you guys are here, I will be going to SneakerCon Houston on December 1st. That is right. It is official. I will be going to Houston. Never been to Texas. Never been to Texas. So I'm very, very excited. Anyone out there, man, make sure if you guys are out there, link up, man. Hit me up, yo. And also, I'll be going to Indianapolis on this, uh, November 25th. Uh, it's going to be on a Sunday. I'll be in Indianapolis. I'll be going to show the Global Sneaker Expo. I'll be going there. Bam. Make sure you guys check that out. I'll have that. Make sure you guys follow me on my IG. I'll announce... I put all this stuff on my IG and everything, so, and all that good stuff. So, yeah, I got, oh, man, I got a lot of stuff going on, man. This has been a crazy, crazy year, but I'm loving it, man. Thank you guys so much. I really appreciate y'all, all right? Anyways, uh, if you guys don't mind, please hit that thumbs up. Subscribe if it's your first time here and comment down below. And please hit that bell for all the notifications for when I do drop big guys, all right? And just comment down below. Let me know, did you guys get the sneaker app? Did you guys get that early drop? Like I said, a lot of people ate. And I, I believe so, man. A lot of people ate, man. I think that's a wonderful, great thing. But if you guys didn't eat or you guys, you know, was at work and you missed it, do not worry. December 8th will be when they finally release and everybody should be able to get a pair. Okay, guys? Anyway, guys, that's the interview, guys. Appreciate y'all. Love y'all. I'm Jumpman Chris. Peace.